Alright, what's going on everybody? Welcome back to Let's Play Final Fantasy X. Now, the reason why I'm on this screen is because I accidentally hit the next, like, entered in the next scene without um, pausing it, so I have to just jump back into the game, so here we go. Save the current game. Yes, we will save the current game. Um, there was a cutscene that was playing, and all it basically said is that, hey, you lost. That's literally all it did. Now, it is a shame that we didn't get the Strength Sphere, because that makes a huge difference with the new character that we're going to get in our party, but in the end, it's not too horrible. Like I was saying last episode, that game is ultra-rigged. Like, they just do not give you the opportunity to really fight them fair. And, like, as a result, that that's why I think this game is kind of BS, honestly. I like playing Blitzball on my own. I think it is, like, a perfectly fine game to play. But it's still just really... It, it, this first game kind of turned me off of it. So anyway, we have some fights now. And this is pretty easy, it's just hack and slash. And that's basically it. But there's a lot of them. So you might need to keep your HP up if you're not careful. But um, aside from this, we don't have much else to do. We don't pick up any more items from here. And it's a lot more cutscenes. And we're actually about to get into the uh, the area that I was finally saying is kind of like, you know, where the game opens up. And that's what I'm really excited about. Um, the next area we're going to is the Meehan High Road, which I'm actually going to take a little bit of time to play this game on my own to level up my characters. Um, Meehan High Road is a very challenging area if you have a weak party, and I really don't like having my characters underleveled. So I try to keep them as, I wouldn't necessarily call it overpowered, but as high leveled as I can um, within the limitations of what kind of experience the enemies will actually give off in that area. So I'll try to do kind of a before and after thing and I'll show you guys what the sphere grid looks like whenever I get there before I end that episode or whatever. And I'll show you what it looks like. Ooh, dang, Waka. I'll show you um, what it looks like after after I've done all my leveling, which, I, again, I'm not going to make it to the point where, like, the game is boring to watch, but I am going to get it to the point where I'm not going to die, like, every three fights, which Meehan High Road is kind of known for having a difficulty spike, so I definitely want to avoid having that difficulty spike destroy the game and this whole LP as a result, because that would be, you know, not very fun for the viewers or me. In case I haven't shown off Waka's Overdrive, I'll show it off in a second. So, his Overdrive is the slot. And these are element reels, so let's see. Oh, damn it. <laughs> um, so, if you match them all up on one element together, it makes them a lot more powerful, and they'll hit multiple enemies, I think, with the element reels. Um, he has three other overdrives that you can earn through playing Blitzball, so it, it does give you a good incentive to play Blitzball, but I don't know if I'm going to do any more of it on camera or just do it on my own off camera. Realistically, I'll probably just do it on my own off camera. I have no reason really to play this game on camera for you guys anymore. A after this point anyway, unless you guys just want to, so if you guys leave a comment below and you guys say, hey, play more, I'll, I'll play some more. And here is Orin, who is just really strong. 
he's definitely like our tankiest character that we're gonna have in the in the party for a long time. Waka actually gets really tanky as well. So you do know him? Yeah, best guardian there ever was. And there are some interesting tricks with Lauren, but if we do dark attack on this guy, that's going to make him pretty much useless for the course of this entire fight. Now, Orin has Power Break, which lowers an enemy's strength, and he has a whole bunch of other break abilities. I'll go ahead and apply this one on it, just so you guys can see what it does, if he ever gets the chance to attack us. Which, he may not, because right now it's kind of looking like he might end up missing all of his attacks. I didn't see how much HP he had left, I'll have to look at that. Okay, so he still has Blind on him, and he's got oh, not very much HP at all. He'll probably die on the next hit. Maybe? Mm, not that one. Ooh, that was kind of dangerous. That'll kill him, though. And another level up. And here is more just raw Seymour action. May your eyes feast upon what you're about to see, because we won't see this for a long time after. And yeah, we'll go ahead and save the game one more time. Something I forgot to mention yes, uh, in like two days ago, I guess, <laughs> a couple days ago um, in that episode, uh, when I was kind of just talking about games that I've been playing, I'll, I'll let this play out either, first. Captain. Shouldn't you heal up first? Yuna needs me with her now. I can't be lying around in some bed. Yeah, but... Come on, look sharp! The blitz season just started. Don't make those faces, yeah? Well, see ya, boys. You be good. Captain. I can't hear you! Captain! Is that I've been playing like a lot of Shadow of the Colossus. I, uh, I've recorded Are you sure? halfway through the game now, like almost. Anyway. At the time I'm recording this, I think I'm sorry for making you wait. In the sixth Colossus now, sixth or seventh. Up. So I've made a pretty good headway at this point. Um, technically, eight is halfway. Back. But so, um, 
I actually good think maybe this. halfway might be a little bit closer, hey. like eight or ten. It's good to you know, be back, nine or ten yeah. actually, rather. Maybe like after the ninth Colossus is really halfway through because the last Colossus has uh, a lot to do, and it so, takes a long time to get through it. Any news on what happened? Not really. We don't know where the fiends came from. Maester Micah is safe and sound, thanks to Maester Seymour. That's about it. Maester Seymour's Aeon. It was so powerful. Oh yeah, we're in for the long haul with these cutscenes, by the way. Hope you don't mind sitting here and listening. Hey you! Don't just stand there! All of this is your fault! Getting swallowed by sin, ending up here in Spira, not being able to go back to Xanarkin, everything, everything! I'm telling you, it's all your fault. <laughs> Who are you anyway? You knew my old man, didn't you? Yeah. And you also knew Yuna's father? That's correct. Hey, man, there's no way. That's just impossible. Nothing impossible about it. Jack, Roska, and I, together we defeated Sin ten years ago. Then I went to Xanarkin, where I watched over you, so that one day I could bring you to Spira. Why did it have to be me? Jack asked me to. Is he alive? It depends on what you mean by alive. He is no longer human. But then, I felt something object there in that shell, couldn't you? You must have felt him when you came in contact with Sin. It can't be. It is. Sin is checked. Uh, no, that's ridiculous! No way! I don't believe you! But it is the truth. You'll see for yourself. Come with me. If I say no? Every story must have an ending. Now, I don't care about your stories! I see. Sorry you feel that way. Fine, then. Come or don't come, it's your decision. What am I supposed to say? You tell me it's my decision! But I don't have a choice, do I? You're the only one who can tell me what's going on anyways! I have to go with you! I have to! Irritating. I know. Or are you afraid? That's up to Jekt. I'm going to offer my services to Yuna. Come. Oh, come on. <laughs> Sorry about that. Um... This is a pretty intense moment in the game, like emotionally, honestly. It's it's a wild ride seeing what happens up to this point, and there's not really a good point to stop. I don't know if we get another save point for a while. Oh, well, never mind. Prove me wrong, why don't you? Uh, we're going to go ahead and call this episode here. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next episode of Let's Play Final Fantasy X.
Hope you guys enjoyed the video, and I'll catch you guys next time. See you later.